Hello, everybody. It's a little bit early in the day, so I'm kind of half awake here, but bear with me because I got some stuff to talk about. I do actually have a DF thing to talk about at the end. It's kind of a speculation, but about a thing that might get made, which I'm kind of excited about. Um, but the, the first thing I want to talk about is scheduling. Um, I am changing my schedule kind of drastically. This is the first major shift I've made in my streaming schedule since early 2020. Most of you probably, if you're subscribed to this channel, know that I stream on Twitch full-time. That's my full-time gig. YouTube has always kind of been a side thing for me. Um, I'm shifting my streaming schedule from five days a week to three days a week and extending the hours that I stream pretty dramatically. Instead of aiming for about eight hours per stream, five days a week, I'm aiming for about 13 to 15 hours uh, per stream, uh, three days a week. Uh, the happiest I've ever been was a very brief period of time where I was allowed to work 10 hour shifts with a pretty long commute at one of my old jobs. And I really wanna get back to that point. It was a four day a week shift um, and so I'm cutting my stream schedule from five days a week down to three days a week. Now, I'm babysitting a cat right now. I don't know if that picked up on the microphone, but hello. Um, I, now, I do not, I, I do realize that this sounds kind of intense, right? It sounds like a very long schedule, but hear me out for a second here. Currently, the way my schedule works is I stream five days a week. I also do YouTube stuff, and I have a podcast that takes quite a bit of time and scheduling time. So between streaming and the podcast, and the editing, and the, the the interviews that I do organize and set up, which take quite a bit of behind the scenes time, I, I'm working seven days a week right now, and it's not sustainable. Um, I've been extremely burnt out the past mm, two months, m even more so even, uh, and it's been varying levels of either extremely burnt out or just relatively burnt out. And I'm trying to remedy that. Uh, so this is my attempt to do that. Now, I'm still going to end up working about five days a week, and I'm still going to be doing more than 40 hours a week, that's for certain, but hopefully the ability for me to actually get some time off to rest in between the streams uh, on my days off is going to increase my energy and my mood when I'm actually streaming. So my schedule going forward on Twitch is going to be uh, 9 a.m. until late uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. And then on Friday, I'm going to record the podcast and edit stuff for YouTube that I haven't already edited. DF News happens on Wednesdays now, so that's when those videos are going to go up every other week or when they post. Um, and then as outside of that, I get to do extra stuff. So this allows me to put a little bit more focus onto the YouTube channel than I currently have. I'm going to try and increase the production value a little bit. I'm going to try and make the the VODs present themselves a little bit better. We'll see if I have time, if I can work time into my schedule to actually edit bits into the VODs. We'll see. Um, but that that is the hope. That is the plan going forward. Um, and part of that plan is to not uh, turn myself into working like seven days a week again. I wanna at most work five days a week, maybe six on a busy week. Um, when Steam DF does eventually launch, hopefully this year, I will definitely do seven day a week streams for a couple of weeks. That's just kind of a given. Now, my little speculation thingy uh, is, some of you probably have seen Noclip's video featuring Tarn uh, and uh, all of the cat story. It, that video's got like a million views now. It's one of Noclip's more successful videos. Well, I myself wasn't that happy with that video because I read that interview like eight times that year and that video, I was way too excited for it and I wasn't super happy about how it came out. Um, they just posted a video on uh, the Noclip YouTube channel basically talking about that they're going on a road trip driving up the Western coast and uh, talking to a lot of developers. Anyway, they highlight the general vicinity where uh, Zach and Tarn are from and then show footage of Tarn from their previous interview. So I look at that and I squint and I go, what are you planning, no clip? Hopefully it's something cool. Anyway, that's basically all I have. Uh, if you want to support the work that I do and you like the interviews that I do and you want to see those get better, uh, <laughs> there's one uh, coming pretty soon uh, with the developer of Odd Realm, which I just recorded a couple days ago. And that's going to be out hopefully this coming week at some point, and um, if you wanna help those get better, uh, my Patreon's in the description of this video. Outside of that, if you wanna hear my voice more, there's a link to my podcast as well. Thank you very much for watching this little update plus scheduling things, and uh, I hope you guys don't miss me too much on my days off now.
Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, 9 a.m. Pacific until late. Show up. Come say hi. We'll see you when I see you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.